Hello, how are you doing today? My name is David Valdez and I represent New Mexico's most trusted source for alternative healing to the ingestion of cannabinoids from the most versatile, most medicinal, and the safest herb on this planet. Cannabis, marijuana, hemp, they're all the same thing. Now we have over 25 years of experience in the industrial and medical uh, space <clears throat> industries in relation to cannabis and the cannabinoids and oils that they produce. Now we're going to be talking about some tinctures today. CBD tinctures is what we're going to be talking about specifically. Now, what is a tincture? Now, tinctures were the most common cannabis um, medicines leading up to prohibition. Every single physician, medicinal healer had a CBD tincture of some sort for some reason, and lots of reason too, for colic for children, uh, pain. Queen Victoria used it for her menstrual cramps, and so um, you know the queen who could have anything in the world she wanted to wanted cannabis tincture for her menstrual cramps because she knew it worked. And the queen gets what she wants, right? <laughs> now. Um, Typically, tinctures were made with alcohol. Now, more, more often now, they're made with uh, olive oil and coconut oil and other sorts of oils. Now, uh, can they still definitely be called tinctures? Well, we still call them tinctures sublingually uh, that they're used under the tongue. Now, how do we use tinctures? Now, tinctures are a sublingual, orally used uh, medicinal product, meaning that it goes under your tongue and it gets absorbed into the body that way. Now we here at NM Brief Relief believe that medicinal tinctures uh, used under the tongue are the best, least expensive, most absorbent way to use CBD and we recommend it uh, for everyone. Now you can use CBD in a variety of products, edible products, vapable products, there's honey sticks. Uh, uh, however, they're using the same oil just infusing it into these products and it just brings up the price. Uh, packaging, labor, ink, uh, extraction, uh, infusions. And so therefore, it does bring up the price of the ingestion of your CBD. But you know, to each his own. There are a variety of products that you can get, hard candies, uh, uh, trail mixes, all kinds of edible products you can get infused with CBD. Or make your own. Now, why do we want to use CBD tinctures? Now, CBD is a non-psychoactive compound in the cannabis plant that doesn't get you high, doesn't get you stoned, doesn't get you dirty to fail your analysis for your work or whatever. Now, believe it or not, we mammals produce a form of CBD or a form of cannabinoids like THC naturally in our body, <laughs> believe it or not. Yes, I did say that. We humans, we mammals, produce a form of THC and CBD naturally in our body in what's called the endocannabinoid system. Now, the endocannabinoid system is a group of indigenous cannabinoid receptors called the CB1 and CB2 receptors. I'm going to read this to you because it's really scientifically. Now, endocannabinoid system is a group of indigenous cannabinoid receptors located in the mammalian brain and throughout the central and peripheral nervous systems consisting of neuromodular lipids and their receptors. So in English, <laughs> that just means that it is connected to our central peripheral nervous system, so like our lungs, our kidneys, our liver, our stomach, our brain, our bones, our muscles, are all connected to these two receptors that produce a form of cannabinoids to help fuel them. Now when we ingest any cannabinoid, but specifically CBD with the most medicinal properties that it has, it gives fuel to this system so that our bodies are working to the best of their ability. The endocannabinoid system is responsible for maintaining homeostasis in the body. And so therefore, basically, so that all of our systems are working to the best of their ability, regardless of what any external poisons, you know, what we drink, what we eat, uh, something that we can, pollution, secondhand smoke, stress, all of these have an impact on the body and the endocannabinoid system helps ensure that we're all working to the best of its ability. Now just like any other molecule or vitamin that our body produces, sometimes we're deficient in them and we need supplements. 
Now with CBD or cannabinoids, nobody has been able to really ingest any form of cannabinoids for the past 50, 80 years of prohibition. We are barely starting to do that now and we are getting tremendous positive results. I mean, you hear it all the time. CBD is here, CBD this, CBD that. Um, now, who can use CBD tinctures and who, and who will CBD tinctures work for? So, CBD is safe for anybody to use. CBD and benefit from it. Uh, parents can give it to their children, to your pets, your furry friends. Um, when your children are sick, it'll help. When their children are sick, it'll help eradicate the illness from their body. It's an antibacterial, so it'll help also to keep them uh, from and prevent illnesses from occurring in their bodies. It's an antibacterial to stop from any bacteria building up in the body also. So it'll kill bacteria if it's in it or help prevent it from, in, from uh, taking hold. It's a neuroprotective, immunosuppressive, um, and those are just a few uh, medicinal benefits that come from the CBD uh, um, uh, cannabinoid. Now how else can CBD be ingested? Like I said, there's edibles, there's vapables, there's smokables, and so you can get flour that has no THC in it, roll it up like a joint, and smoke it. Uh, there's shampoo, conditioner, bath bombs, facial cosmetic products, uh, facial cream, eye serum, uh, hair serum. There's a lot of benefits and omegas and vitamins and minerals that is inside CBD and, and cannabis and cannabis seed, uh, hemp seed oil that brings all these wonderful benefits. There are topicals like lotions or salves that are wonderful in treating pain or skin illnesses. Um, how low? Again, we're gonna say that a tincture, we believe, is the most medicinal way to get CBD into your body. However, uh, there are other ways to do so if you need to. You can vape it, you can roll it, like flowers. There's CBD pills, capsules, edibles. Um, regardless of how you ingest your CBD, it will have a positive impact in your body and in your health. Again, CBD doesn't cure any diseases, it doesn't treat any illnesses, it doesn't diagnose any illnesses, but it does give your body the tools it needs to help maintain that endocannabinoid system so it can do its job and get homeostasis in your body. Um, now, why do you wanna choose buying CBD from NM Brief Relief? Now, we here at NM Brief Relief have the experience, the knowledge, the contacts, and the know-how to ensure that you're getting the best quality CBD that is on the market today. That's on the American market, more than much less to say. So CBD stores sell second, most CBD stores sell second hand CBD. Now, just like any other product out there, there's top grade product, there's like middle shelf product, and then there's low grade product. I don't care what kind of system there is or what industry they're in, they're gonna have these levels. Now we strive to be at the top, have the very best, the least expensive, and the most medicinal CBD tinctures or, and or edible products and that you bring into you. Now I know from experience and from some personal stories that are almost out, outlandish nightmare stories of people ingesting CBD or what they called or bought or thought was CBD turn out to be Honestly, I don't even know. I think it was reprocessed hemp oil or something because it was really gunky, really oily. It didn't smell good. It had these little like chunks inside of it. And mind you, this was for an 11 year old with a serious bone illness. And this is just one of dozens and dozens of stories that uh, I have heard or personally gone through myself. So all that said, most CBD products or stores sell CBD that was grown and extracted in China, Europe somewhere, the Middle East, uh, even from Russia. And so you don't know the quality control of them. Uh, how can you 100% trust the products like that? I know from experience and personal stories being told to me about horrific stories, like I said before. And so you wanna be sure that you get somebody that you know will have top quality, 
grade A or triple A, 100% pure, American grown, American processed and packaged CBD products. Uh, we're all about keeping it in the family and not sending our work and our money outside of our country. Like I said, so you can ensure that every single CBD product we carry is an American farm grown, American extracted, and American packaged and sold. We believe 100% in our products, especially our CBD tinctures. We will give you, we will also give you a four or five day supply of them so you can see for yourself and, and try it before you buy it and, 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 and see that it will work for you because we know that it will. And that's why we do that so you can see if you've ever tried CBD before and you know it didn't work for you you spent a lot of money and you ingested it all and it didn't have a positive effect in your body then more than likely you got an inferior product and so that's why we would like you to come on down if that's ever happened to you come on down to our store we'll give you a sample of our tinctures or our salves or both so that you can try it before you buy it and see that if you do ingest or apply a top quality CBD product, you're gonna ensure that you're gonna get those positive results and your money's worth and help to live a healthier, happier, better quality of life through our programs at NM Brief Relief where we say we get your pain relief in a brief and I'm telling you within minutes, our staff starts to work. Within days, our tinctures will have an effect and within a month or two, your whole body starts to change around and start getting better. It's, it's really miraculous. Uh, we have two locations conveniently to serve you in our Albuquerque, 4730 Pan American East Freeway, right off the frontage road off of Montgomery on the east side of the freeway. There is a Nexus restaurant and brewery that is in the same parking lot and building as us and a Best Western Hotel that's right in the front. So you can't miss us, we're right in the middle of both of those buildings. And if, and if you're in Española, if you're up north in northern New Mexico, we are in Española also, uh, 912 North Riverside Drive, Suite B in the corner. There's a smoke shop on one side and a lone place on the other. We're kind of hitting in the corner, so you might have to kind of search for us, 11.30 to 5.30, Tuesday through Saturday in both locations. And uh, thank you for your time. If you have any questions or concerns, please give us a call or a comment on the bottom and ask us and we will reply. Please share this with all, everybody you know. Give us a like, give us a thumbs up, and tell all your friends about us. And again, thank you for your time and get your hemp on. Get your hemp on. <laughs>